Hey everybody, thanks for tuning in. It's about that time and we've got the new November. November Mystery Tackle Box. It's, it's somewhere. There it is. <laughs> Thank you. You're and, welcome. Uh, so we're going to open it up and see, see what we got. As always, I haven't opened it. I haven't watched any videos. I don't know what they got going on this month. So it's all my first time seeing any of it. So it's an original reaction. I'll give you, wait, you get the, no, you need that. That's what she needs. Yeah. So right off, I'll give you, it's got the sticker. That's a cool sticker. They're getting oh, whoa. bigger. And I like that one. Better. If you've ever seen my Instagram, I, I put all these stickers on my fishing table downstairs and when it's full, I'm going to hang it as like a background. Um, I'll say they got, that's new. Little holiday catalog. That's a holiday catalog and gift guide. So it's got lots of things that you can buy. Wish list. It's got a little wish list on the back, which I'll probably be filling out later. But I'm gonna let her read off the list, and I can already see something I almost bought a few months ago at the store and thought they were cool, and now I'm gonna get to actually check them out. Thanks, Mr. Tackle Box. What? You've been challenged by Carl. Catch a fish in your first ten cast with one of these lures. Share your challenge on. With hashtag Carl's challenge. I'll definitely challenge accepted. <laughs> Alrighty. I will, All right. I will read that later, but that was the dip that's in the that's in the dibble, so if you've got the dibble you'll you'll get to see the challenge by Carl. Alright, what's inside? Catch co bubonic <coughs> Bug Square Bill, eleven ninety nine. Oh wow, that looks nice. I was wondering, it's it's, cri it's getting cold around here, so I'm I always get excited to see what they give me November, December, January. There we go. That's a uh, pressure to cut my glasses on. Two and a half inches, half ounce. I like that box. It's, that's it's like a. Uh, it says its color is mud bug. It's tape, of course. It's taped. I'm not putting. It out. Opens up. Mm. I like that box. It's neat. I keep all my boxes. I got totes full of every bait I've ever bought. If it came in a box, that that got it downstairs. Oh, it's clear. I like that. Um, right off the bat, I like the bottom. I like the color on the gill. I like how people are starting to use these inward turned trebles. You get a better hookup ratio with that kind of inward teardrop looking shape. It's nice. Got some noise to it. That bill um, said it was. What did it say? Mud bug. Half ounce mud bug, two and a half inch. It doesn't say a depth on it that I can see. I might be missing it. Mm -hmm. I like to miss stuff a lot. <laughs> By Chris Grout. I think I'm gonna pronounce that right. If not, I'm sorry. Colorado. Okie dokie. I'm gonna try to. You guys don't want to watch and put it back together. What we got next? Ooh, okay. Does it say? I didn't see a depth on it. That's a pretty. No. I mean, that's a pretty squ not square just, bill. Yeah, it is a square bill. Well, I mean, it's a square bill, but not the real shallow. I'd say three to five or yeah, no, three no to depth six, something listed. like that. Um, live. I don't know nothing. <clears throat> the next item is a live target. Crawfish crankbait, nine ninety nine. Wow, can't go wrong with that. Another. It's the second time I've gotten the mystery, the Cabela's Bass Pro Shop exclusive. i gotten, I don't know, maybe they got a bunch of them on, they got a deal on them or something like that. Mm. They're good baits, everyone, both of them I've gotten. Holy crap, I can't get it open. There we go. So this one, let me see what it says about it. Size 2 inch, 3 eighths of an ounce, 4 to 6 foot depth on this one, and we'll... Half of my video length is me just trying to get the dang box open. That's bright. I like that. <clears throat> I grew up on them little ones. You get them from the store, and they're like real tiny little crawfish crankbait. It's got a, once again, that's that. it's still got that kind of, it's not as pronounced as that last one, but that kind of, yeah. that kind of interned. It looks like. That, that colorway is weird. It's got like breaks in it where it's clear. Yeah, I've never seen anything like that. Yeah, that's different. That's definitely a different look than crankbait. And I think, like I said, it's got a little kind of deep rattle. It's got some eyes that are protruding. Yeah, that's a, that's a crazy... 
Neon Yeah, that's I'm stoked to use that. The double D. That's a, it's it's kind of dirty. It's been kind of clean lately, actually. So yeah, that's not in there. So don't let it fall in. There. <laughs> Somebody. All right. Perfection Lures Sure Hookup Shaky Head five ninety nine. There we go. I've almost bought oh, those. Those are yeah. the standy ones. Those yep. are cool. I'm not gonna go through those. ripping that all open, but as you can you can see, it's got little feet down there, so when you drop your jig down it sits and holds your bait up off the bottom for a a floaty style presentation. Um I use the E-Man a lot, they'll hold themselves up, but that's still kind of cool. It's got those little feet, so it's going to drop down, and it's going to put your hook up like that, so when it, it's, it's, you can hop it and shimmy it. I've seen some video of them moving across the bottom, and they look, they look pretty neat. I was, I've almost bought them quite a few times, and now I'm going to try them out. Good stuff. Those are eighth of an ounce. Eighth of an ounce, yeah, thank you. I didn't even look. Yeah, eighth of an ounce and green pumpkin. It says bass on it. Designed for finesse, worms, crawdads, lizards, senkos, grubs, and tubes. Maximize hook set efficiency. Yeah, three pack. That's nice. I'm, I'm starting to try those. Okay. Getting on jig time around here. It's always jig time depending on who you are. Right. All right, next item is the Strike King Rage Tail Twin Tail Menace Grub 549. Yeah. Oh. Menace Grub. It's a Menace Grub. We all know it. You can't what go wrong. What color do we got? Did it say? Probably not. It's... <laughs> They're like, just use it, it's Strike King, you know, it works. What does the color look like? It's like, I think it's green, it's got some gold and red flake in it. These slam, you put this on this and give it a little hobby hop and you'll get bit. It'll take a while, but because it's cold. Stuff started freezing here last night, so the bass are definitely going to be a little... You gotta put it right where they're hanging up at. They're gonna be holding tight cover and stacked up on top of each other and not really wanting to move very much. So, little stuff like this on a Texas rig or wet little jig heads or something should not be bad. All right, ready? What's next? Carl's Amazing Bait Flicker Worm, three ninety nine. Oh, nice. Something else looked good on that that jig head. Get one of these out here. That's a little kooky. Oh wow! Yeah, check that out, guys. Does it have a flat tail? Yeah, it's got a bulbous tail. It's got oh. a flat bottom though. You can probably there it goes. Yeah, it's got a flat bottom on it. Um, that's weird looking. And it's two tone. Definitely, like. definitely different. Yeah, it's it's uh like copper flake like, on the on the bottom. Yeah, it's like black and red on the top, black with red flake on the top, and then on the bottom it's white with like some copper and blue. It looks nice. It's a nice looking bait. I never, I've never seen one shaped like that. That's pretty cool. I'm excited to try that one out. Yeah. There's one, two, three, four, five, six, eight, seven of them. Yeah, there was only there was only five in the last pack. Oh, yeah, yeah, there's only five. Yeah. And the last but not least is Big Bite Bait Swimming Crawl. This one tells you the color. Yes, it does. <laughs> Swimming Crawl Prime Rib, three inch. Called prime rib, prime rib. big bite baits. You pretty, pretty standard staple in the Mr. Tackle box. That's fat. That's got like a thick body, and it is. It's it's. <laughs> it's got. <laughs> it's got a, a, a hole, mouth hole type thing. That's pretty neat. Yeah, the. I've never the, seen something like this that. This part is solid, but this part is hollow. Um, it's got those those ribs on the pinchers to give it vibration and stuff. Um, a few months ago, in a Mr. Tackle Box, I got some bass. They're actually over there on the, the bench. I got some bass little pills, look like fish oil pills, and you stick them into your tubes and your soft baits. That actually fit right in there. It's got like a mouth. It's kind of... It's yeah. They're over there. <laughs> yeah, I think they're. I think so. I can't remember. They're on the bottom shelf, if I'm not mistaken. That or that might be those cart pellets. No, these are them. The Lumper Hunt spicy baits. Yeah. Take capsules. Take you one of these and plop that bad boy right down in there. What work? Ooh. 
Boom! And then when that where disintegrates or breaks down or you pop it, it's gonna it's gonna smell like garlic. <laughs> I, I couldn't resist it. Anyway, yeah, these they don't smell like anything. Hey, well, once you put one yeah, of things in there, that's a it's a full pack. These are cool. I like that color. It's got a nice color to it. Like I said, it's getting colder around here. It's about time to pull out the Texas rigs and the the jigs and the, just slow dragging the bottom for them. That's all she wrote. Those are going to be some good baits to, to pull across the bottom. So yeah, we got the, the big bite baits, Carl Amazing Baits worms. You got the Menace Grub, which you can't go wrong with a Strike King Minute. The Menace Grubs are they're, they're awesome. I've got a stack of them down there. You got these, what they, the Perfection. Perfection Sure Hookup. Sure Hookup, Shaky Head. Three pack. These aren't in the box, so I'm just gonna. No, I got the Live Target Crawfish Crankbait. What is that? The. It's the Catchco Bubonic Bug. Bubonic. I can't This guy has some kooky. So bubonic bugs, that's, that's a cool one. I'm excited to try that one out. That's in a crawl pattern. That's it. And then the awesome sticker. big old awesome sticker. These stickers really are getting bigger and badder. So I'm pretty stoked. It's it's the cold month, so I'm still going to go out there and grind it and try and catch the ones that I can. And these are definitely going to gonna help me hook up box of fish. So you guys are out on the water, stay safe and tight lines. And if you got a box, I hope you guys enjoy it. And we'll see you on the next one.